I'm Brownfield Commodity Market Reporter John Perkins, and this is your Market Minute for Wednesday, the 21st day of September. Soybeans and corn both close lower, keeping an eye on U.S. harvest activity. Most near-term forecasts do have a generally cooler pattern ahead for much of the Midwest and Plains, but there's only expected to be limited precipitation, and that should help things move forward. Past that, corn and soybeans are watching early planting activity in Argentina and Brazil. Wheat closed higher, shrugging off a higher move in the U.S. dollar index, continuing to keep an eye on the situation in the Black Sea region. Russia is likely to call up more troops to further their incursion into Ukraine. That would, of course, have an impact on Ukraine's exports and winter wheat planting. Live and feeder cattle were lower, getting ready for widespread direct cash cattle business. Direct cash cattle markets were quiet during the session, with widespread trade probably waiting until Thursday. USDA's cattle on feed numbers are out on Friday afternoon. And hogs were lower, pressured by the sharply lower midday move in pork. USDA's monthly livestock slaughter and cold storage numbers are out on Thursday. With your Market Minute for Wednesday, September 21st, I'm Brownfield Commodity Market Reporter John Perkins.